So I want to talk about something in self-defense. It's very typical for people to back straight up. So if someone is being aggressive towards them, they're coming into their space, um, it's very natural for people to move back away from that. They're scared, they don't want to get hit, um, and it's very natural to move straight back. However, that can be a problem, uh, as in this example. So say I'm facing off against Bob here, he's, being, uh, he's got his finger pointed at my face, and I'm trying to de-escalate the situation. Hey, you know, it's okay, it's, we can talk about what's going on. So as he gets more and more aggressive, I get scared, I start to move back, um, and then, then this happens, and suddenly uh, I'm caught up with, with this monster here who's like taller than me. He may, may grab my arms uh, while, you know, Bob won, uh, you know, pummels me into oblivion. So what do I want to do about this instead? As the confrontation is starting here, um, you know, it may be very natural for me to take at least one step back, uh, but I want as quickly as I notice myself doing that, I want to start to circle away. Uh, and I don't want this to be obvious to, to my opponent, so I don't want to start doing this. You know, he's going to figure out that I know something, I don't want that. Um, so I'm going to use sort of chaotic footwork where I'm like, oh, you know, please don't hurt me. Um, but, but I'm moving in a, in a uh, semicircular fashion. So, uh, and that can work really well if, if now I can see both opponents. So I've moved into space that I could see with my peripheral vision, I can see here. Um, so I've moved towards that way, and then that allows me to take a look at what was behind me originally. Uh, so this allows me to see all of my environment. 